Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are. Remember, you are greatness inside of you. Welcome back to another Ab Daily News with the Hockey Coach Guru Coach Frenchy. Today, episode number 376, Weather Minute Coach. First of all, of course, the Ab News, following by the Abs Ménage à Trois. Hmm, interesting. But before we start, guys, we invite you, please don't forget to click on the like, subscribe to the Hockey Nation Live Show, and leave us a comment about this episode. And let's dive in talking about my first subject of the day. My first subject of the day, guys, about the Montreal Canadian News. And the first player we want to talk about is we got a new DJ inside the locker room for the Montreal Canadian. And it's the captain, Nick Zuski. In the last couple of years, the DJ was Joel Edmondson. But after he got traded to the Montreal Canadiens, to the Washington Capitals, Nick Zuski is going to be the new DJ for the music inside the locker room. My second player we want to talk about today, guys, is Adam Engstrom. Really great news about Engstrom. He started the exhibition game with the team in Sweden Hockey League as a first pairing defenseman. Unbelievable. This is a great news for the Montreal Canadian prospect Adam Engstrom. By the way, if you want to hear a little bit more about that news, you can watch my video under my other channels called the Ab Nation. My third news of the day, guys, about the Montreal Canadian prospect. We got a couple of players already played a couple of games yesterday. Their defenseman, Nurmi from Finland, got three assists during his first game exhibition game. Opposite of Vincent Rover with the Zurich Lion did not do any point. Same situation for Oliver Kapanen. Then my next news of the day is about Justin Barron and Langstrom. We know Langstrom got trade from the Detroit Red Wings to the Montreal Canadiens. And that's complicated the situation for the right side for the Montreal Canadiens. We have already David Saval, Kovacevic. We know Whiteman is still there. But for the third pairing defenseman, who is going to be that player for upcoming season? Is it Gustav Langstrom or Justin Barron? The problem for Justin Barron is a waiver exam. So he can go directly from the Montreal Canadiens to the Laval Rocket for the upcoming season. Would be very interesting what Martin Saint Louis going to do for its front position for the upcoming season. Example, the goaltender, the right defenseman, and of course, its front forward prospect for the Montreal Canadian like Allenen, RHP, Anemann, Joshua Hua, or Owen Beck. They're going to fight to get one or two spots for the upcoming season with the Montreal Canadiens. That's it. That's all, guys. This is all we got today on the, all the news for the Montreal Canadiens. Let's move on for my second subject of the day. My second subject of the day, guys, about the Ab Ménage à Trois. Hmm, interesting, coach. First of all, guys, the Montreal Canadiens are three goaltenders for the upcoming season. Jake Allen, Casey DeSmith, and Samuel Montembo. All three played in NHL last year. Is it possible Montreal Canadiens keep all the three goaltenders for the beginning of the season? If it's the case, a forward or a defenseman are going to pay the price. Because if they keep all three, one spot is going to be out for a defenseman or for a forward. The good news, Montreal Canadiens have a lot of players with waiver exams so they can send directly from the Montreal Canadiens to the Laval Market and American Hockey League. One thing we know in NHL now, most of the team need three goaltenders during the season. Many injuries affect many different goaltenders. Last year, in NHL season 2022 2023, over 107 goaltenders play in NHL. This is the second highest number of goalies in one single season in NHL history. Jake Allen said during an interview, the game is so fast, injuries are more and more frequent because young. People play hockey more and more often. The body accumulates millage at a younger age. I think that in the future, we will see three or four goalkeepers very regularly through the year in one regular season. This is exactly what I just said. In the future, initial team need at minimum a three, if possible, four goaltender for one regular season. And finally, guys, I feel like the NHL should add another player on the roster for each team 
every year, go from 23 to 24. I don't know exactly how they can do that for the salary cap, but I feel it's necessary now. NHL team need at least three goaltender per season. This is something they will have to consider in the next couple of years in NHL to give the permission to each team to add an extra goaltender inside of the roster. We know the goaltender does not like to go to the practice the morning with three goaltender in the team. I understand that. But because you have so many injuries, this is the reason I believe possible at the beginning of the season, Montreal Canadiens could start the season with three goaltender. I would like to hear from you guys. Let me know what you think about that subject. Abs menage à trois. Do you feel a Montreal should or should not keep three goaltender at the beginning of the season? If not, which goaltender you think the Montreal should trade before the beginning of the season? That's concluded, guys. All the subjects we have on this episode. Thanks for watching another video of the Ab Daily News with the Hockey Coach Guru Cold Frenchy. But before we leave, guys, we invite you. Don't forget to please to click on the like, subscribe to the Hockey Nation Live Show, and leave us a comment about this episode. And of course, you have greatness inside of you, and we wish you an amazing, great, blessing day, everybody. <laughs>